check it, check it. One, two, check it. Check it. <clears throat> <clears throat> Ladies and gentlemen, my name is Charles the Awakened, and I'd like to welcome you all to Source and Back. <gasps> Episode 1 The Big Picture. So I lay back. And as soon as my body is totally flat, I feel what appears to be a snake or a serpent inside my chest. The shaman places her hand on my chest and intuitively starts following this snake as if she knows it's there. She moves faster until her hand is where the head of the snake is and it dissipates. Right after that, in my big toes, I feel a wave start to go up my body. It felt like half my body was submerged in water. Once the wave got up to my chest, it crashed against it. This happened several times and I have never felt a sensation like that before. And then that's when I heard it. I remember thinking to myself, this is getting primal. And then it came back to me that the shaman did own a rooster. From there, I felt my body shift to the right, shift to the left, then shift to the right again. And when it shifted to the right that third time, I kept going. Outside of my body, all I could see is the color blue, but I had the distinct feeling I was moving. I noticed something far off in the distance to the left of me. When I focused in, it was a Chase lounge chair, the leather brown one psychiatrists have, and I was laying in the chair with my arms dangling off the side with my eyes closed. And from there, what appeared to be a picture appeared in front of me. From left to right, it was the beginning of everything, and the ending of everything, and everything in between. What's fascinating is that everything in the picture or existence, if you will, was all happening at once, and only for what we would consider a split second of time, which represented all of time. I then was hit with this immense feeling of bliss I have never experienced bliss on this level. Talk about euphoric. It was so intense and encompassing. I also had the feeling that in that moment, I was not only the orchestrator, but also part of the orchestra. There was no separation. In addition to this bliss, there was this understanding that Whatever I just experienced was my true natural state. From there I began to see what appeared to be white poofs within the blue which slightly resembled clouds and I now had the overwhelming sensation that I was descending. I knew I was returning to my body. For those who have skydived before it felt exactly like descending to earth after one shoot had been pulled. I returned to my body in awe. It was told to me later by those who were present that shortly after I went in, I started to repeat this particular line over and over. We are one. We are one. We are one.